Well, you guys may be wondering where Christy is. I've been wondering the same thing too. We're up here in West Virginia visiting some family and uh, I haven't seen her hardly at all. <laughs> I mean, there may be an explanation. I just, I don't know what it is. We're going to the Hannibal Dam. Uh, you guys may recognize this uh, location from a couple of other videos that we've done in the past. Um, but it's just a really cool place to fly. We're gonna revert back to a video that we released probably about a month or so ago, where it showed some speed restrictions on the uh, drone whenever you had the gimbal facing 90 degrees down. So we have proven that, and it was in the manual, uh, so I guess I didn't really prove anything, but we've basically proven that the manual was right and that whenever you have the, the gimbal facing down, the speeds are restricted in normal and cine mode, but they're not restricted in sport mode. So what I got curious about was, I wonder if the gimbal will restrict the speed on the return to home um, function uh, if you have the gimbal facing straight down. And that's what today's test is gonna be. We've done a lot of return to home tests in the past, and we've been able to show that the maximum speed uh, for the return to home function in any mode is going to be 28 point or 23.8 miles an hour it's always fun referring back to these old, older videos that we do or these older tests because we always seem to miss something and there's always seems to be a question that somebody has that sparks our i guess our thought process this is probably the nicest day that we're going to have up here in west virginia this week while we're here we got here the other day it was 20 degrees and yesterday it didn't get above 35 or 40 i don't think and then today, magically at 75 degrees ish. Well, then the next couple of days is going to get cold and rainy. I've gotten spoiled flying inside the truck. <laughs> Let's see here. We'll park right here by this glass. <laughs> All right, let's get this stuff going. I'm going to turn the truck off. I'm going to sit here with my windows down, I think. Not bad. Ugh. Oh, making a bunch of noises like an old man. <laughs> what the heck was that? One thing that I haven't mentioned is that it's gotten awfully windy today. So let me look here and see if, see what the winds are like. So right now the winds are at 24 miles an hour gusting. <laughs> and that's at the ground level, so holy cow. If I go up to 300 feet today, yikes. I may get some wind warnings today. Let's see what happens. Let's <laughs> see what Jack can do. You ready, buddy? I'm gonna get you calibrated. <laughs> We've got our satellite, 17. We've got a strong GPS signal. Got a strong RC signal. Got 99% battery. We are screen recording. I'm gonna record in the drone too. All right, let's get this thing started. Take off. The home point right. has been opened. Jack's up in the air. Check it on the map. Put the gimbal down to like 10 degrees. Alright, let's sit here and let him hover for a second. Get acclimated. And we're going to go out towards this. Uh, we're going to go out towards the bridge. Alright, so everybody again knows that the return to home speed is... 23.8 miles an hour. That's the max speed no matter what mode you're in. So I'm going to go out in Stinny first. I think we're acclimated here. I'm going to go up to, let's say, 60 feet. That way we're not going to hit anything. <laughs> oh, I guess I'll go up to 70. I'll go up to 80 feet. All right, so I'm up to 80 feet. I'm going to just fly, I think, straight out to the, uh, I'll go straight out to the bridge. I'll go, let's say, um, let's say we'll go out to uh, 500 feet because he's got to have time to get up to his max speed on his return to home flight. I'm going to go up to 100 feet, actually. Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot to check the, make sure that the return to home height was set. All right, so we'll go out to... I said 500, let's go out to 600 feet. All right, so we're at 630 feet. 
Let me check here and make sure that the return to home height is set. Where's it at? There it is. Let's go to 125 feet. All right. Let's get Jack turned around to face us. Hit return to home. We're going to let him get up to his max speed, and then I'm going to lower the gimbal. There's the dam. All right. Return to home. RC not connected. What happened? Well, this ain't good. <laughs> Why is the RC not... Oh, I turned the power off. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. <laughs> I hit the wrong button, guys. <laughs> I turned the power off. He's already returning to home. All right. <laughs> Let's pause it and regroup. <laughs> wow. I've never made that mistake. That was stupid. So we're still at 600 feet out. Let's hit the correct return to home button this time and see what he does. <laughs> Jeez. That was stupid. What a rookie mistake. All right. So he's, he's going home now. He's at 10 miles an hour. 15, 16, 18, 23.8. I lowered the gimbal. It did not affect the speed in Cine mode. Well, it didn't do anything. I'm going to cancel it. It didn't do anything. So it didn't have any effect whatsoever. Huh. Let's go back out there and we'll go there in normal mode and see what happens. And don't hit the power button this time, you dummy. <laughs> Man, what am I doing? All right. What did I, what were we at? We were at 600 feet. All right, so we're gonna go back out to 600 feet. I can't believe that I did that. So the max speed for normal mode right now looks like it's about... Well, we're hitting some pretty good wind. It's speeding up a little bit, but... I can't believe that I hit that... Man. All right, we're at 500 feet. 600 feet. There we go. All right, let's get him to turn back around and face us. We're in normal mode. So Cine mode, it didn't affect that speed that at all. It was still 23.8 miles an hour. Plus some. So we're 650 feet out. We'll hit return to home. He's raising up to, or he's already there to his, to his height. So we're coming in, coming in hot. <laughs> 20 mile, or 18 miles an hour, 20, 23, 24. All right, gimbal down. 23.6. It slowed down a hair, but I think it's because of the wind. Or maybe it's because he was so close. So let me cancel that. All right. Well, then we're going to go out there in sport mode. We're going to do this one more time. Get out to sport mode. We're going to get out there fast this time. Look at it. <laughs> He's already at 23 miles an hour. Or right, lowered to gimbal, too. There we go. See, his speed is limited because he's only at 26 miles an hour. We got some really good wind going here. Let me go out farther than this. There we go. I'm going to raise that gimbal back up to 6 or to 10%. All right, let's come back and face us, Jack. There we go. All right, return to home. Here we go. Speeding up, 15 miles an hour. It's going to be at 23.8. All right, he's at 20. He's at his max speed. Gimbal down. He didn't slow down, but can we speed him up? Whoops. We can actually speed him up a little bit too on his return to home flight with the gimbal facing down. So that gimbal didn't affect the speed at all. That's our answer, guys. All of our questions are now answered. <laughs> I got a rock in my flip-flop. I was, 
in my truck talking to myself and there were some people that walked by and gave me a look like what is that guy doing and that's some interesting results. I was actually kind of expecting to have the drone slow down with the gimbal facing down like it did uh, before. But nothing inhibits that return to home mode, I guess. If you guys have any ideas for future videos, please leave them in the comments. We have a, a running list of uh, questions that people are, have been asking lately, and we're going to hopefully address those, those uh, questions in the near future as far as the video goes. You guys have come up with some really good, really good questions and some really good video ideas. So we want to thank you for that. Well, we want to thank you guys for watching. We hope that you enjoyed the video. Have a good week. God bless.